jury duty. Too often, folks get that notice to appear for it and then immediately start strategizing ways to get out of it. But should we start thinking about jury duty differently? Here to talk about this important issue is attorney Paul DeMore. Paul, welcome. Thanks for having me. <laughs> of course. So I could almost hear the collective groans when I said <laughs> jury duty, but you say it's an important service that we provide as a community, and you actually wrote something recently on a blog, right? Why did you feel the reason to? Well, all too often, as you say, people get a summons for jury duty and start thinking of ways to try to get out of it. And it's actually, I would like, and I think that the lawyers across America would appreciate if jurors start thinking about it a little bit differently. Uh, it's actually the most important right each of us possess in, a demo in the democracy in which we live. It is the most direct way that we can affect the law and the outcomes of, of our lives. Uh, every day, lawyers across the country and across the state of Maryland go into court seeking to right wrongs, seeking to correct some injustice that's happened. A dangerous product has hurt someone. Someone's been hurt in, in an automobile accident. Someone's been the victim of, of negligence of someone else. Um, or a crime's been committed, and, and someone either needs to uh, answer for that crime, or maybe the government got it wrong, and the person's been unjustly accused. Jurors make the difference. Mm -hmm. They decide how these cases or, or how, what the outcome of these disputes are. And you say that jurors actually allow the people of the community to decide the outcomes. So before that wasn't necessarily always the case? No, before, before there were juries, the, the, the crown or the king or whoever yeah. was in power would decide what happened and Just uh, rule. decide the dispute. Right. So imagine you're accused of a crime by the king right. and the king then decides whether you're guilty or not. Yeah. And that. so because that was so unfair, you know, the framers of our Constitution actually thought that this right to juries was so important. It's actually part of two separate amendments in the Bill of Rights. The Sixth and Seventh Amendment mm -hmm. each speak to the right to a trial by jury to so settle disputes. If someone is watching right now and they got this jury duty notice and now they're like, okay, I hear you, Paul. I'm not going to, you know, groan about it. What advice do you give them? Show up. <laughs> Oh, oh it's, it's, don't look at it as if it's a summons that requires you to go and, and do something you don't want to do. Show up as if it's an invitation to participate in our democracy. Mm -hmm. Go with an open mind. And when you're questioned by the, the court or, or by the lawyers, tell the truth. Mm -hmm. Tell them how you feel. But keep an open mind and promise yourself that you'll be fair. Because if you can decide a case based on the evidence that you hear and the law that you're, that you're provided by the court, and if you're willing to listen to that evidence, you're a qualified and excellent juror. And too many people think that they're not, that someone else can do the job better. But they can't, because juries are supposed to be made up of every member of the community. We need people from every walk of life to participate, to give their thoughts of, of how a dispute should be settled. Mm -hmm. And juries don't make sense if they're just made up of all the people that think they're the best mm -hmm. to, to make that decision. Everyone's the best to make that decision. You're right. I mean, it is our civic duty. And you, you think a lot about that, you know, after the fact where, you know, you didn't necessarily have the jurors that you wanted. And so it, it makes sense that everyone should show up. So let's recap real quick. I know we have sure. a couple of slides that you wanted to get to. Sure. Just, just, and again, you can go to our website and we'll have a, a, a much more uh, detailed blog about this, but just to recap, you know, you, you're participating in governing, okay? It's, it's, a, it's a very important part of our democracy. While you're there, you're gonna learn something. You'll get an education on the justice system, what and you may find things that you think are good or bad about it, mm -hmm. and you'll probably learn something about whatever it is the cases that you're hearing. And, and I've, I have never failed to have a juror come to me after a trial and say, you know, I didn't wanna be on this jury, but I really I learned something idea. and I'm glad I served. Jury trials actually are, are meant to prevent tyranny. It's, it's our way of making sure the government isn't overreaching. Right. No more kings. No more kings. <laughs> right. And, and other countries actually look at our jury system and are jealous of it because it's such a unique part of our democracy. All right. Thank you so much, Paul. And give us that website one more time. That's demoreinjurylaw.com. There'll be an article right on the front, front page, first page of the website, or you can go to our Serious okay. Injury Center. Thank you so much. And we'll be back with more Midday Maryland right after this.